Now for the movie you've all been waiting for, friends. This is the APM Holiday Mystery Box. Seven boxes at a certain amount shipped. Uh, guaranteed to be overvalue uh, with Marvel, Indie, and just a touch of DC. And yeah. So let's see what we got. This is box number two. And I watched and I saw that his wife numbered them at random. And so there was no like finaglery. There's no like, you know, just put that there and that there. It was all random. And we're going to see what we got. So the last time, oh man, what was the last time? I'm looking around at my books like, no, no, no. What was the last one? I forget the last one for a second. So it'll come to me. It'll come to me. So, this is... <laughs> I can actually sleep on this bubble wrap right here. You know what? I can, I can probably make like a camping pad out of this bad boy. Just kind of lay this out and just... I mean, it's pretty much the thickness of a camping pad. At least in my experience. All right, thank you for picking up the Adrian APM Holiday Mystery Box. Your support means the world. Have a wonderful holiday. All right, and TSMB fam, another box for me to use, so that's super cool. And another sleeping pad. All right, let's see what's in here. I can see that there's no slab of labbies, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, <laughs> he marked off all the, the ads. That's fine. Oh, are they all upside down? They are all upside down except for one. So this will make it easier for me. Adrian APM Holiday Mystery Box. Here we go. First one's up. Oh, here we go. Wonder Woman Future State number one. We know what's a touch. So dash of DC. All right, we all know what this one's about. And if you don't know, I'm sorry. And I don't have time to do the research on each book and go, oh, this is the first one. If I don't know, I don't know right now. Because I'm just pulling them out of the box. Boo bam Oh, hey, now. Along came Sabretooth, X-Men uh, number six. This is actually, I used to own this one as a kid. I used to own, actually own two or three of these ones. All right. Next up. Dope. Dope, dope, dope. Gambit and B uh, versus Bishop. Enough said. Enough said. Uh, number eight. Special appearance by Ghost Rider. Duh. So that's seven. So that's six and eight. And oh, I'm starting to see a theme here. Um, Wolverine versus Ghost Rider. See, he's, he's he's not having this. Not having this at all. He's like, you know what, Ghost Rider. <laughs> ah, I'm, start I'm starting to see a theme here. Ooh, a certificate of authenticity. Oh, hey now. Batman 50. Oh, th actually, this is a pretty cool cover right here. Uh, signed by, uh, signed, signed, signed by, signed by Dawn. <laughs> this is signed by Dawn. Signed by, uh, I want to say McTeague or Teg. McTeague. It's not McTeague. So I'm going to go with Don McTeague. I don't know that my... Last names. But either way, uh, signature is right there. But this is just a really dope cover. I mean, it, it's, yeah, it's it's super cool. He's got the the whip in his hand, and she's got the battering. This is actually pretty, pretty cool for being an X-Men for being, uh, X -Men book. Uh, for being a uh, DC book. Next up. Oh, Ghost, haha, <laughs> Ghost Slinger Spawn. I don't have this GameStop exclusive, but now I do. It's right here. Bam, bam. I think, I, I think, I personally think this is the best versions of the new Spawn situation that's going on right now. I just think he's a, just a dope character all the way around for being the lowest powered of them all. This is a pretty thick book. What's it going to be? It's going to be thickness. Giant size. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is Giant Size X-Men number two. This is a pretty good looking book. When Sentinels when Sentinels strike, oh. 
You know, you know, this is a cool book when this is this is when Beast had a really just dope outfit and just really big feet. This is super cool. Sixty-eight pages of good fifty cent goodness. What's next? Uh... Why have I heard this one? Four kids walk into a bank. Oh shoot! I know there's some hype about this one, but either way, it's a black mask, and I'm a huge fan of black mask comics, so I know this is gonna be a dope book, and I'm pretty sure at some point this has been optioned for something. I don't know. I, 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 it's, it's right here. It's at, it's at the forefront, and the thing with my them. All right, next one. <laughs> well, this is super cool. Because I actually just sold my recount that I got from Comic Tom. And it's super cool to have this one because this is even a rarer version. <laughs> karma. Comic Karma. I love it. Thor. Hey, I know that guy. He's got, I have a big old, you know, poster in my room of this dude. Hey, hey. <laughs> um,. Thor limited series, one of two. Marvel Cinematic Universe, official tie-in. What? So you see, he put he put a he put a little preface on this whole thing right here. I think this is the this is the big book. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna look this up before I even say anything about it, because I wanna know a little bit more. Give me one second. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. This is this is this is the big book. This is a 1983. Uh, super cool. I don't even believe how clean this is. Um, on page five of this book it happens to be, we're going to do a little comparison. I'm going to open this up. I probably shouldn't even touch it, but I'm going to open it up. I'm going to show it to you. Oh my God. Look at this. This is, this is just amazeballs. Be careful and cautious because what happens is that you get this. You got it, friends. The first appearance of the black suit. Oh, and I put that up there on ha at happenstance, too. That is freaking wild, guys. That is wild. I just happened to put... The, which is really funny and weird because I got that book from Adrian APM as well. And I got that book from Adrian APM as well. So this is the comic reader number 215. Featuring, you know, this is this is this is when this is how people hyped books before the internet. They would do these magazines and they'd feature upcoming books. This is the preview of Spider-Man's Black Suit pre ASM two fifty two. Well, Secret Wars is right there, but two fifty two itself. Um, wait, oh never mind, two fifty two. You know, sorry, my bad. But either way. This is, this is the big book, and this is my number one cover pick, because it shows Spider-Woman and the Silver Samurai, which is dope. And then I'm going to go through the rest of the books. I mean, this, is, this, this one's really hard to pick, which, which covers I like best out of this whole group. Adrian always brings the value. I've, I've never... I've, I've had mystery boxes before, and they've been whack. And some of them have been, you know, meh. And some of them I have, like, the same damn comics five times over. And, you know, they're worth something, but there's no variety. But this right here, I thought it was going to be a whole X-Men lot. So here, the comic reader, that gets a top choice. Only because it's freaking Black Suit Spider-Man. Um, we're going to move on. I think this is funny because I just sold this one um, for a pretty decent amount. Um, Giant Size X-Men because, I mean, look how cool this cover is. Gunslinger Spawn wins, too, because 
I think he's just the dopest looking one. And then I'm going to have to say... Um, Alright, you know what? I'm going to have to say it right now. Anything with Bishop on it is just super cool. He just looks so badass. He is so, it's so 90s with all the buckles and straps. <laughs> so, Adrian APM. This is the holiday mystery box. He's bringing the heat and the fire. He never disappoints. If you ever have a chance to see him on... Um, go subscribe to him on YouTube, Adrian APM. Um, just start there. Um, follow him at Solid High, the comic guy. Okay, I thought I wasn't recording. I was like, oh, shit. Um... Uh, Solid High the Comic Guy, follow him on Instagrams, and he will let you know whenever he's part of the next auction. If he has a blind pull box, get a part of it. Seriously, if he's got something up for sale or claim, get a part of it. Best dude all the way around. I mean, everybody else is super cool too, um, but Adrian has pretty much... <laughs> I am now like three short boxes because of this guy. With that being said, oh my god, I can't believe... Oh my god. Ah, that's super cool. I never thought I'd have that in my collection. I thought that'd be such a pipe dream to own something like that. Um, and, and actually just have that sitting right there without even realizing what was in that box yet. So thank you so much, Adrian APM. All you guys go follow that dude. He is worth it. And he's just a super nice guy in general. Um, thank you. That's, thank you. And Merry Christmas and happy holidays. And... <laughs>